awful and bad tempered. So Karula's territory will shrink a little bit as she goes along. And you'll probably find that as she reaches the end of her life. Ooh. Something's really upset her. A warning star, she's snarling at one of the other vehicles. She's not snarling at us. We quite settled quite far away, but she is just giving one of the other vehicles a little bit of a rev, which is interesting. It just goes to show, because they're not close to her. They're not overly close to her at all. It just goes to show that I think we made the right decision in not trying to move to where we could have got a better visual of her before. Something's put her in a little bit of a mood, and it's important to remember that these are wild animals. And sometimes they have good days and sometimes they have bad days, just like human beings. You never take anything for granted. So she's done that to me once before. And I had absolutely no idea what had happened or what had gone wrong. And I still to this day don't know what had upset her. But she just decided actually she wasn't in the mood for us. As you can see, she's settled down now. She's pulled the carcass around. She's actually pulled it closer to the vehicle. The Karula family lineage, from Karula to Tandi to Kunuma, they're known for their, the odd snarl every now and again. <laughs>